now as i'm doing this video right now neo stock price is up over seven percent and some of the people or some of the investors are wondering what's happening well china just unleashed some massive stimulus to stimulate the uh, the economy of china or the gdp for china which is something that is pretty exciting i mean here's what china is doing or it's about to do or which they announced today they are going to re reserve the repo rate mortgage rate cut for existing loans they are going to boost lending to consumers and corporates they are funding brokers to buy shares or stocks and bank loans are being going to be issued to support buybacks and this is something that is just incredible it is for this reason that we are seeing stocks surging booming like crazy because china wants to make sure that they boost of course the stock market or the stocks and uh, companies like neo companies like baba companies like uh, Xpeng and the Asdas, it is for this reason that today they are surging cr so crazy. I mean, Neo stock price at a certain point was at $5.80 because of this massive news. I think this is incredible. This is a good initiative, though it's not the first time we are reading some of these. But this package, this stimulus, I think it is pretty good, pretty exciting, and it will make companies like Neo. And this is good news to companies like Neo because then you are going to have banks, you are going to get loans for doing buybacks on companies, which is something that this is bullish to the stocks, uh, to companies like Neo, which therefore it is absolutely crazy. So I'm happy, I'm excited about this. And when I read this, in fact, when I saw almost all the Chinese stocks, I mean, Baba, it's up over 6% because of this. When I saw this, I had to go and do some digging and when I found this it had to be the one that is making all of the Chinese stocks to surge the way they are today. I mean I'm very happy about this. I'm very excited. I mean you know that the GDP forecast for China I think for Q4 it's currently at 5% and to get to that China believes that this will help them meet or get to the 5% uh, GDP growth which they are expecting or they are forecasting to get to in Q4 which I'm happy as an investor I'm happy to see this kind of gains as a new investor I'm happy to see this stock rising or surging by 7% and who knows maybe by the end of today we see this stock surging by double digits or plus 10% which will be so great to see once again it is a day where we are seeing short sellers being burned because of this new stimulus that china just announced today so tell me what you think about this if it's the first time you are hearing this tell me what you think brokers are going to receive fundings to buy stocks bank loans are going to be issued to support buy bags and they are going to boost lending to consumers and corporate to of course uh, stimulate spending right i mean this will make now people go to buy the new uh, cars like crazy because they will get some boost or they will receive some boost to be able to go buy cars to be able to go buy houses which will uh, grow the economy or which will stimulate the chinese economy which is something that as that is taking place companies like neo will be able to also get some good gains because of that will be able to generate more sales because of that and when we talk of companies like neo this is not the first time we are seeing also this boost to this stimulus becoming to of course from the government trying to support uh, the chinese economy i mean when you look into the new energy vehicle or the car industry in china as a whole the chinese government has is already issuing subsidies to help this fast growing uh, new energy vehicle market i mean those that are swapping their old cars for new energy vehicle market they are getting up to 20,000 rmb those that are swapping their old cars for gas cars they are getting 15,000 rmb yes and as, as we have discussed before this simply means that china wants new energy vehicle market or they want their streets to be flooded by the new energy vehicle markets which is why they are offering more subsidies as compared to when you are swapping your old car for a gas car this is just clear china wants ev cars this i think we don't have to debate more on this and it is for this reason that companies like neo have got a bright future in china companies like neo are just set for greatness and to put or the add the cherry on top of these stimulus that we're reading today it is also massive because it will make a uh, consumers to be able to afford these ev cars like neo to be able to afford the ev cars like onvo 
Firefly and the others, which is very good, massive bullish news on to Neo. I mean, even for the mortgage, the one for where they are cutting the mortgage rates for the existing home loans or for those with existing home loans, it will also give a boost into spending. People will be able to buy more cars, which this, this, I, I, I mean, Q4, we must just brace ourselves for what's coming because with this, we can expect record-breaking deliveries or more record-breaking deliveries coming from our favorite socks like neo because a lot of people will be having uh, money to spend or extra money to spend and uh, what better way to spend your money than to spending it on a ride during the festive seasons or getting your neo car your own car during the festive season and when you are spending your time with your family you are spending it driving a new car this will definitely bring a boost into the market this will definitely boost companies like neo onvo which we look forward to so this is part of the reason or this is the main reason rather we are seeing the chinese stocks surging i mean i see a lot of a lot of new investors coming in in the streets of social media celebrating the gains that we are there seeing today i mean it's it's a no-brainer that companies like neo will receive a lot of people buying or banks will buy also neo stock because it is a company which is just set for greatness fast growing ev industry which company will be the one to come first probably onto these banks in the i i tell you neo will be one of the companies that they will go for because they see the potential they see where the stock could be and it has been be turned down quite sharply bringing or offering opportunity to those that are uh, loading the board right now because in the long term they will receive the benefits the rewards that will come when the share price of neo heads back towards the all-time high of $66.99 so I'm happy tell me what you think about this I just thought I just give you this quick updates uh, I, I think these are massive bullish news and we need to brace ourselves for the kind of sales that we'll see in Q4. Q4 is starting on Tuesday. So from Tuesday, we need to expect great things because of this new stimulus which China just announced today. I cannot wait to see the kind of sales that we are going to see. Companies like Neo Generating, because of this, I cannot wait to see uh, the kind of revenues in Neo and Onvo will generate because of this. And this can only mean one thing. We need to brace ourselves for what's coming if we think Q3 earnings are going to be way better as they would have produced record-breaking deliveries which might come with record-breaking also revenue generated um, for the quarter. I think we have to brace ourselves for Q4 because Q4 it is about to go down. Things will be happening way better than what we are seeing right now in Q3 which therefore just means one thing and that is blue skies coming. So do your own DD. That's all from me. I wish you nothing but the best in your stock market investing journey. And God bless you all.